I think. Definitely bigger. I don't think I've caught one this big yet. They're all like this. We're in for it. We're in for it. Yes, guys. If this is the he said there are, the average is real good in here. Oh, he wasn't kidding. They're thick. Look at that. Pretty female. Check it out. Now the day is turning around. Pregnant black female crappie. About 10 you inches, 10 and a half. Bird. You should go outside. Man, I just had a nice one. Oh, oh my God. Oh, on the missile. Crappie usually don't bite something this big this early in the year. Oh man, there he is. There he is, Wilma. We got another one. All right, guys, I just caught him on a three and a half inch bait on the missile sock wave chartreuse and white. I thought it was a bass. He hit it three times and kept coming back. Oh, oh man. Another pregnant female black crappie, guys. Backpack around. Nether, nice. Pregnant female black. Look at that. I was gonna anchor too, and then that happened. I guess not. I need you to throw that in the cooler, I guess. That's a keeper. I got a big one. I think it's a crappie. Yep. It's feeling like a crappie. I could be wrong though. Yeah, crappie. Yes. Yes, it is. They're just off and on. It just once once in a while, guys. We can't get on these crappie consistently. They're just real spread out and isolated. They're not in schools in this lake. But when you get one, every one is 12 13 inches and pregnant it's my third one and they're all been females and about 12 and a half inches my goodness and it's when you least expect it because you'll catch about 30 bass for every crappie but it's worth it when you do get a crappie wow all right don't do any sudden movements don't jerk or nothing 
All right, guys, crappie number three. Another female with eggs. I'm going to say she's 12. Guys, let's see if I can get another one of them. Put this in the cooler, I guess. That's not a crappie. I already seen it. So You need a weight, obviously, if it were. You know what? You might not need a weight. I'll give you one, but oh, hold that up for us, honey. Well, we got her first crappie of the day, and there, it's another 12. That's the horrible view. Oh. <laughs> Move your arms over this way. There you go. Okay. Uh, hold it up one more time. I didn't get a good view. Like sideways and then hold your arm over here. Do just like you're doing, but hold it first. Horizontal. Like sideways. Okay. If you can. Good job, honey. There you go, like that. Man, that's a giant. That is a nice crop, you guys. Wow. I'm getting ready to. <sighs> it's a bass. No, it's not. Look how black he is. Oh, he's jet black. Guys, I didn't think it was, I thought it was way too early. He's jet black, We've got a male. Every other one's been a female, that's why. They've all been females. He is jet black, guys. I got him on the orange dream sickle, my personal favorite. Well, I found a spot that's snag free, that's why I'm not using minnows. Oh my gosh, guys. Look at that jet black crappie. Now we've had a good day, huh? Wowzers. All right, do not make any sudden movements. Guys, this is a beauty. I'd rather catch the males, even though the females are bloated and big. I just love these dark males that are jet black like this. Wow. Look at them cheeks, guys. Jet black. What a gorgeous copy that one is. These fish are biting better as the day goes on. The bass were biting all day, but the crappie, they're getting more active as the day goes on, I'm noticing. Okay, go ahead and open the cooler. Wow, look at that. That's a nice one. Oh, I like them black ones like that. There may not be a whole bunch of them here, but hopefully. Looks like we found a little spot if we caught two of them. We just caught more crappie in one minute than we did almost the whole day. So that's gotta be something. Giant, giant one. Oh my gosh. Look how black he is on the bottom. Look like, looks like he rubbed him in charcoal. Guys, Orange Dream Sickle is the number one crappie bait. I don't care what anybody says. It outdoes all of them. Oh, whoa. All right, doubles, guys. They're all, everyone's 12, 13 inches, too. There's no smaller fish in here. 
She's got another one just like me. You got another male. We was catching nothing but females. I know what it is. The males are in the shallower water. The females are still out deep. He's not black yet though, not like mine. Mine is big. <laughs> it's bigger than yours, see? Oh my goodness. Okay. Nether. Okay, don't move a lot. Nether jet black. Wow. We got, what, six of these now in the cooler? Yep. Six? Five or six? I think it's six. Yeah, let me hold two of them and you film me. I always like to have a picture of the double. Two. Okay, I'll take a photo. I will after you do that. Careful now, get the hat. got to curl their tail every time. Might be a female. It's hard to tell. Uh, that's a male that just ain't dark yet. Really yes. Yeah, that's a decent one there. Man. Probably 13. They're about 12. They're 12. Give me a Give me a Okay. doubt that we'd ever get a good number of crappie it just took finding the right little spot where you don't get hung well not as much can't say that because I just got hung but generally speaking it's not every damn cow <laughs> there he was there he was that was a tree branch Ooh, I about got hung there he was there he is oh I set the hook too soon. There he was again. Got him. Well, guys, this may be my best crappie trip of the year. I will say it was worth paying for it. <laughs> Fell off right at the edge. I should have dip netted him, I guess. I know the trick now. I can't let this lure fall more than three feet. I count to about two and a half and I gotta reel it in faster. They'll come up for it like that. These fish will come up. That way I don't get down in the sticks. All crappie over here, no bass are bothering us now. You notice that? He's on, he ain't getting off. Man, he's jet black too. He's, I think this is the blackest one yet. Oh my God. Wow. Now this is probably the best average I've ever seen. This is better than the coal mine. But we're not getting any 15s or 16. But I'd rather get 
ones, every one is this big. Guys, every one of these is 12 even. Some of them even 12 and a half. Jet black. Crappie. Nothing beats it. Two weeks ago they were gold. When we was catching them, not here, but at a different location near here. They were all gold. There, now they are all jet black. Beautiful crappie. And she's got one. We got doubles. I can tell it's what it is. It's not a bass. I'd put that one back. Oh my God. And I wouldn't. Man, right? Pretty. We'll quit keeping them at a certain point, though. After about 25. Give me that. Don't you think? Keep about 25, then we'll quit. We don't want to overdo it. You don't want to have 50 because then it's a lot of work. Alright, guys, that's our, what, number 11, 10 or 11? Yeah, he's pretty thin. Oh, he's thick. your minnow again. Oh man. He's barely hooked too. Come here, man. Jeez, buddy. Oh, he's gonna get off. He's gonna get off. No, ah. Whoo. Another. What we're noticing, guys, is the females are by themselves, and they're out in about ten feet of water, and all the males are in about five feet of water, also by themselves. They're in different, separate groups. You probably got your minnow stolen, but let it set a minute. Look at these beautiful crappie guys. Whew. Cooler. God, full crappie in here is. Doubles again, guys. I got another jet black male. Oh, he's on there. Right when you said that, it went back down. Oh, come here, you. Hey, welcome to the party. Ooh, God. This guy is jet. Worse than, this is the blackest one yet, right here. He's almost completely black. We got our money's worth guys this is the first time in my life i've ever paid to go fishing but i will say it's worth the experience i never thought i'd pay to go fishing oh wow For a second, if this thing goes in the water, I'm screwed. Oh man, look at that one, guys. Yeah, I'm gonna get him in the cooler and I gotta change my battery for a minute, guys. It seems like my battery's ain't, it's just time's flying because we're having fun. It's, Well, guys, I'm about to try a minnow for the first time. Minnow is really 
good. At least I won't be getting hung. Hold it down a little bit. Right uh, a little bit up. There you go. Yeah, that's a nice one. They're all nice, ain't they? I can't believe them deer just walked by right by us. And I had the battery off. Well, I just had just put it in. There's a lot of sticks sticking up though where we're at too. Got him. And it's not a bass. That's weird. Crappie dominate this area. We're at other areas before this, guys, and you couldn't get a crappie to save your life. Oh, he's 12. <laughs> he's really big chunky. Gosh. My goodness. Guys, this is amazing. And it's only 2 in the 2 30 in the afternoon. No. 10 to 3. I'm gonna try to use the same minnow again. Save them. Make them last longer. He just don't have an eyeball. They might not care that he has an eye or not. Now that's a female. That's a female. See, it's real white and pale and thicker. Yeah. Well, I didn't even have a minnow. Gee, I wonder why I'm not catching any. I don't know. We can keep about 10 more. Go ahead and keep that one. We'll keep about 10 more, I guess. It's about 11. He hit it real hard. There he is. I'm having fun with the jigs. <clears throat> I like the jig fishing. I just sat there with 20 minutes with a minnow and Bobber didn't catch a single thing. As soon as I throw the jig on the first cast, look what happens. I just know how to work them better. <clears throat> I'm good when it comes to jigs, I admit that. Compared to a minnow. Now William, he probably catch two to every one of my one with a minnow and bobber. My goodness, guys. We are going to eat good. I wish there were some whites in here as well, but I'll take these any day. I like lakes that have mixed. All right. Let's, uh, let me get a good picture of myself and we'll throw this one in the That's a big one. cooler too. Okay, don't move for a minute. No. <sighs> okay, we got to kind of keep track. That's about 17. We'll try not, we'll keep only about 25 crappie. That's about all you want to keep. Right by your minnow. <laughs> right next to your minnow. <laughs> I purposely threw my jig right by her bobber, guys, just to steal her fish. Just to show it works that much better. They see it. Well, they can see this bright orange a mile away. I think I know what color I'm going to use today. Maybe the orange dream sickle, maybe? It's working better than the blue ice ever did in here. I caught that one in the morning on the blue ice. Another jet black 12 inch male, guys. 
And like that one guy says, and you know how I do. I hooks them in the mouth. Holla at your boy. <laughs> I haven't watched him in a while. He's funny though. Hook him in the mouth. Holla at your boy. Guys, look how black he is. That's just absolutely crazy how black this crappie is. Don't make any sudden movements. This guy is jet black. That is awesome. And guys, what did we learn from this day? Just because there is a cold front after five or six warm days, it got down to 28 degrees the night before last, and it got down to 26 degrees this morning. And the, the high is only 55. Guess what? We're still catching crappie. It does not slow them down. When they're they got their mind made up, they're gonna spawn regardless. 50%, 50% of the fish getting active in the spring has nothing to do with the water. That is one big misconception. What it has to do with is the days getting longer. It can sit there and stay cold, but them fish know because of the days getting longer, they know it tells them to spawn. So a little secret for you there, guys. Yep. Now I'm gonna be honest, guys. Our first three hours of fishing, I never thought we was gonna do this good. It took that sun being out a couple hours for them to really, I caught one at 10 in the morning and I did not catch another crappie till noon. And then I didn't catch another one for a whole hour. About 10, 11. We put it back. He's decent. Oh, that cooler's gonna be heavy, isn't it? <laughs> Your bobber's gone? Bobber's gone? Oh my gosh, guys, I, I just looked over and noticed her bobber's gone. She's fixing up another pole. It stayed completely underwater for 10 seconds. And she still managed to hook it. I don't know how. I'm surprised you got him. My gosh. God. I got hit just barely though. Man. I'd put that one back, yeah, he's he's only about 10. Oh, 
Oh, he got off. He got back on. He got off. He was on there twice. Gee, I wonder where I'm going to cast. Maybe where I just had to piss twice. Watch this. There he is. Who does that every time they hook a fish? There he is. Richard Jean, he always does that. There he is. What do you think about that, old Elmo? Good God. Amazing how many nice crappie we got. Nether jet black, guys. Ah, your bobber. You can't. You either gotta not fish and take care of what you need to do, but you can't do both. You can't. Your bobber's not gonna just sit there and not nothing happen. You gotta leave it over here until you're done fixing up your other pole, and you gotta cut two feet off your red line because it's frayed at the end bad. Guys, I don't know what the deal is. The, like I said before, the females are separated from the males right now for, for another week. The males move into the shallow water before the females do. The females are still in 8 to 10 feet of water, and the males are in 4 feet to 6 feet. Don't move. Wow. Epic day, guys. It turned out to be amazing. It just took that sun a few hours to warm this water up even if it's two or three degrees that is a big difference for fish cooler and I gotta check my battery again don't forget to cut off about two feet of that line and they're just like they're all in one spot it's weird I cast just 20 feet away and I don't get none oh man yeah that's a nice one Let's get doubles real quick, watch. Man. Man. Hold on, I'll get a good picture of you. I'm surprised I didn't get one. Guys, Wilma with our, I'd say we've caught 20 easily. Probably more than that, because we put five back, 25 already. Every one 12 inches, only two that were maybe 10 and a half, 11. Every other one has been 12. I just wish we'd get one out of the blue that's just a giant, when you least expect it, is what I'm hoping. One that's like 16 or 17 inches. <laughs> Oh man. Oh, I got a big one. It, it kind of feels bigger. This one don't feel right. I think this one's bigger, Wilma. I could be wrong. He's fighting harder. No, it's about the same. He's just fighting harder. It is thicker though. It's a female, that's why. I got me a female, I think. Yeah, you do. Yes, this is a female, and look at it. Look how much thicker this is. There's something crawling on it. There's something crawling on it. This is a female. See how pale it is compared to yours? And how thick their back is thicker. But she don't got eggs yet, though. That's... I don't know. Yeah, one of them round things. Yeah, I'll put her back. That way she can lay eggs. It's actually, no, it's a male. It's black on the bottom and it's starting to have black cheeks. It's a male. Just a little late bloomer. Guys, we got doubles again. My goodness. 
Wow. I can... That thing came off. I forgot what it's called. It, it'll cook out if it... Yeah, I'm getting it off. Is that the butter side? No, not really. We'll keep about three or four more. That thing's probably 50 pounds now, the cooler. That's a male. I guess go ahead and keep it. We'll just keep about four or five more. Yeah. Yeah, we'll put that one back. He's a little, little smaller, yeah. Only about an inch smaller, but it's smaller. Look at this one. Banana. Green, green shad banana. guys I'm trying a new Bobby Garland I've never personally tried it's called baby shad green banana it's it's actually yellow but it does have a greenish tint to it. half of it is clearish green with little bubbles in it and glitter and the bottom is banana yellow I'm just wanting to see if it works just kind of changing it up not that orange dream circle was doing me wrong but just kind of experiment see if this color works and I got to change my battery after I tie this and get hopefully a crappie on this thing God. jeez man ah, green banana with the wind guys green banana works mystery solved they're going bananas over it cool new color to try out though i actually got four or five other new colors i've never tried i bought about 30 packs of these experimental bobby garland green banana pretty awesome Okay, when you get done, I want you to do something for me. Never mind, I'll do it. Just don't move. Alright, guys, green banana. Alright, we got doubles, guys. That's a, definitely a female. Look how pale it is. That's a female for 100%. Yep. I guess throw this guy in the cooler. We'll keep about four more. smaller it's way down there oh my god look how black they've gotten over the day though isn't that crazy they weren't like that in the morning were they it's like today was the day huh i don't think i've Ooh, look at that no this got something wrong with him guys he's got something side of his body nice black crappie though what well, you're letting it
I think I got another female. I can see that snag and I, I, can, I know where to let it fall. I reel it real fast until I get past it and then I let it drop and they're on the back side of it. Goodness gracious. No, nope, this is a male. So is yours. All right, guys, this green banana is pretty, pretty awesome. And she's using a blue, a bluegrass, Bobby Garland. Banana versus bluegrass. This one is. Maybe two more. Keep maybe two more and that's it. We're getting too many. He didn't fight much, did he? He just let me ski him in. Another jet black. Oh, jet black banana crappie. Jet black banana crappie, guys. Oh. What a beauty. spinnerbait and just keep moving spinnerbait only that way we do not get hung all right Wilma's on oh I guess throw him in we'll quit keeping crappie then unless we get like a 15 or 16 I haven't even looked in here yet. Hold it open for Oh my god. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> Bubble gum with a chartreuse tail. We're gonna try it. You got one? Yeah, she does. So I'm gonna try something different. The old Charlie Brewer. We're, we're, we're letting Bobby Garland go. At least I am. For a little bit. Not that he's not that it's not working I just like to change it up I have experiment I haven't really tried pink today yet did the orange dream sickle blue ice and uh, the banana so we're gonna try pink with a chartreuse tail keep doing that I'm not zoomed all the way yet oh my gosh okay so totally horizontal Okay, good job, honey. I think, guys, we've caught, that's the last one for crappie. We've officially caught, I'd say we caught 50 crappie in two hours. We kept 25, put 25 back. We have caught the hell out of them. I don't know if I want to rig this with the tail pointing down or the tail pointing up. I would say the tail pointing down is going to do more. It's kind of a hard decision, really. Oh, man! I got hit hard. He swallowed. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yes, he did. <clears throat> Guys, we just got double 12s again. This guy inhaled this Charlie Brewer. I mean, uh, I may have to cut the lure off. No, I can get it with my pink, pinky. Maybe, I almost had it. All right, guys. 
Woo wee. Yeah, we're throwing them back now. All right, guys, Charlie Brewer Pink Bubblegum. 12 inch crappie again. Whew. Wow. What a beauty. Oh, what a horse. Look at that one. Gosh. Wow. Now that's a that's a gorgeous one right here. Green, black, real tall. I've only let my lure fall one foot. One foot. That's all you need to let it fall. Oh man, he got off right at the edge. He was a big one too. One foot. I, I can see my lure as I'm reeling it in. Oh my God. Did you see him? Because you're not fishing right. You heard what I just said. Don't let it fall more than one foot. You're just going to scare all, every fish away. Oh my God, he's got some backbone to him. Whew. Wow. Every one, 12 inches, Thir he's 13. My God. I would say use minnows so you can quit getting hung for we don't so we don't spook them. You're letting it fall way too far. You have to just zip it through here like that where you See, just a foot under the water is all you need at 12 inches. Yeah, I know. They're that shallow. And set, we'll set your bobber a little up then. You got your bobber too deep. You only need it 12 inches. Even I'm going to throw a minnow. I got to tie a hook back on the feet of water where there's nothing but wood. It's tough. Real tough. Oh, he got me wrapped around the branch. He got it. I got the branch and him. <laughs> it fell off finally. All right, I got him with a minnow, guys. There's a little something different. These fish are impossible to reach with a lure now. They're that close to the bank. They're in two foot of water and there's nothing but wood everywhere around. It's big pine trees that have fallen in over the years. It is impossible to work a lure through it without losing them. Yeah, I got my bobber set the shallowest I ever fished, 12 inches. I'm fishing that shallow. Guys, another nice crappie on the minnow. That one took a little patience. It had to set about 30 seconds. That's because they're wising up. Got snagged so many times over here. Still nice crappie. 